The Saiyan. What's up, Crack? How you doing, buddy? Okay. Move a card, choose a rare card. Rare card. Essential Bean. I was just talking about it. I knew it was going to happen. I'm going to go for it. Yes, it's going to make it kind of hard to kill things or whatever. Make it maybe take more damage, but we're getting we're farming common relics. That's like totally worth it, right? Gain one strength. Put a full moon and a great ape form in your drop. What is great ape? You're huge. One transforming. Gain 15 key region 8. Whoa. We get a full moon and a great ape form in your drop. This is very good too. I wonder, I mean, I wonder if you could put multiple sentient beings on a, um, on an enemy. That'd be interesting. The upgrade of this, instead of doing invincible, it's, it's going to be 12 metallicized and 4 strength, which is kind of rough, but like, okay, yeah, we're getting common relics. But I wonder if this is better, because we gain 8 plated armor, 4 strength, and 15 key region. And we become a great ape. No, that's just sentient being. I think sentient being is interesting. Let's, let's go for it. Since we're farming common relic from minions, what I'm gonna do is um I'm gonna um, go for more minions here and maybe skip elites. And I'll use my minions I use the minions as elites in a way, right? So if I kill this thing. What the hell just happened? Oh, I activated the sensu bane. Duh. You can't lose more than three per turn. Alright, I was just making sure it wasn't lying. Obviously it wasn't lying. Ancient tea set. Hey, free relic. Game key region is very nice, but we liked after image, right? Without the upgrade, it's a little bit worse. It's two days, but when you upgrade it, you gain one buffer only one days, which is not too bad. <clears throat> so my 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 relic is you gain five key region at the start of battle, and you also during the first five turns of a battle, whenever you a debuff applied to you, you gain one max HP and one five temporary HP. This is also pretty good early as well. Um, let's go for the after image, even though on upgrade is a little bit suspect. So sense means I'm going to have to fight this guy all over again. It's, it's sense means kind of hard in this guy. I don't know. I don't know about this one. I don't know about this one. Sense of me that job is going to be very painful. Don't you think? Tell me how to kill the whole thing. I'm gonna have to kill the whole thing over again. I used to be max HP, but when the Vormer goes away, I get max HP and temporary HP, so it's totally fine. It, it works works out. Get the days out of the way. We're gonna need, we're gonna need that buffer for. I just messed up. If I did the Rufus blow first, I actually had to kill. Whoopsies. So much for the buffer. It's gonna be painful. A sense you being. Uh oh. Let's see how this works out. But it's for a common relic, so it's if this if so keep think of it as an elite, right? If technically this is considered an elite, like I guess we're fine with a little bit harder jawworm to get a common relic. Probably totally fine. It's also a sense of zero, by the way. Smiling mass, let's do it. <laughs> I'm holding a gunpoint? Really? Is that how you feel? 
Follow up. Yell really loud in, in order to gain 6 key and 12 block. That's awesome. It's a follow up and you gain... When you upgrade it, 12 key, 16 block. You get a written power. It costs one less energy this turn. Oh, this is my kind of this is my kind of jam. Follow up. Deal two damage three times. Three damage three times. Key enhance one additional. So it's like short boomerang. I like the CC capsule. Retain a card. Gain one strength. Lose one strength at the end of your turn. Kamehameha. Consume 16 key. Deal 20 damage. Finisher. Cause one less energy per combo stack. This is a great card. Kamehameha is amazing. This is like the kind of tax you want. Obviously. So we want to do more key region for, to be playing Kamehameha as, as often as possible. I think I'm going to do Kamehameha and we're going to remove a strike. I thought about Turtle Shell as well though. Get really out in order. Yeah, I know. Alright, so this is a good way to get some Sensu Bean stuff going on. Power stance. Kamehameha. This becomes tw two cost now. Why not? There's not going to be enough... Uh, There's not going to be enough common relics for me to farm. <laughs> Bag of prep, nice. Put a starter or follow up from your drop out. Instant transfer, apply one vulnerable, apply two vulnerable. I mean, this gives me more follow up or, or stutter to make Kamehameha cheaper, right? And makes it vulnerable. So that, that's like, like super good with Kamehameha. You make it vulnerable for the Kamehameha to smack them up. That's an interesting combo. I'd rather full block though. Oh, I don't, I can't even full block. Whoops. Oh, I can't. What am I saying? Exactly, you also take the common relics out of the pool, so it is, it is interesting consideration there. Excuse me, command me up bigger. Gain four key and four metallic size? Sure, why not? We didn't play the buffer, so this is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt real bad. I want to do Sensu Beam, but I also want to command Mayha his face. Should I give? Should I give Sensu Beam on the smaller one? I think I should give it on the smaller one. I don't have enough key? Oh shit. So key's a problem right now. Damn, I want to do this, but it's gonna, the buffer's going to go to waste. So I'm waiting for Command Man out here. Kill, uh, we just have to be another one in the back. I know it's taking forever, but we're farming, farming relics here. <clears throat> Sickness is kill killing me right now. Uh, this sensu bean. Uh, I want to save the finisher for a command man, but whatever, let's just use it now. 
That was, that was three combo there. We don't have enough key for coming. We need we need more key region. I could block block, but I, I'm just gonna do buffer here. Cause my goal here is to uh My goal here is to command me for the win. Art of War, baby. Yeah, sure we, we're, we're, in the least, we're getting common relics out of the pool. So we've got four relics out of this one card. It's crazy. The next finisher effect you trigger this turn gets an additional trigger this time. Additional trigger. What would that work for? <clears throat> I guess... No, nah, that's not really relevant to me right now. <clears throat> deal four damage, deal twice that to all... Deal twice the damage to all of the enemies. It's eight damage AOE and one damage single target. See, double double command would be interesting, but we don't have enough uh, key. This makes it much better. This is kind of risky, actually. It's a little risky. Nice. Make myself vulnerable, but no worries, because he's not attacking this turn. That's kind of nice. Let's do 40 seconds right now. Why not? <clears throat> I'll make myself buffer. If I block, block. No, the buffer's going to get used anyways. I can't give... I can give this... Okay, since you're being on the Gremlin, I'm just suicide. I'm not doing that. That's just crazy talk. I think it'd be too risky, 100%. I mean, Command Man is very strong. Command Man is, is, is wrecking face, but nah, I think it's... We got a common relic anyways. Okay, so we're just getting all common relics, I suppose. I think more more buffers are very nice. Like I think Aftermath is a very good card. I think this becomes even better though. Two vulnerable plus draw card. It's pretty sick. We're just getting all the common relics. I, this is weird. I had something to be. I didn't ask for common relics. Like when I took the common relics out the pool, I didn't expect to get even more. <clears throat> oh well. I mean, I can't complain. Consume twenty key, gain two flight. Flight is an interesting little thing. We should play power, game for block. Let's just keep on keep moving these sand punches. Oh shit! We can to one of these guys though. I, I can one v one one of these guys. I'm okay with that. Okay, with sensor. Ah, but the artifact blocks the sensor beam, doesn't it? That's unfortunate. Let's do this. There we go. I didn't want to test it. I think Sensor Beam would have been blocked. I didn't want to test it. Because I actually want to use it. Double buffer here. Uh, so this is a little bit risky to bring it back right now. So we're not going to do that. What happened to my other buffer? What the hell? Was, was that my first buffer? Yeah, I'm going to kill the guy last. Exactly. Which means I probably should have done the... Uh, I should have done the vulnerable on this guy, but okay. Okay. This might be risky to sense you being honestly.
Uh oh. I can't even play Command Mia. Sad face. Not too bad. A cost key to play instant transfer. Whoopsies. Mall bank. Why am I getting what? I get. I'm getting. This is weird. I have every single common relic in the game right now, even when I'm not. This is weird. When you region, key region. Sent to be. Is my look unbalanced? It's kind of strong. But is it fun? Yes. Um, I want to send you being this thing. I want to come in as well. Maybe I should have made myself vulnerable, but it does give me max HP, right? But do we care about taking damage here? I think a little bit. Yeah, we're gonna send you being the, the Laos. Nice. I get even more combos now. Wait, what? Oh, Majin Seal. Oh no, it has his attack randomized. And now this guy doesn't die. Majin Seal actually just destroyed me. Come on, me. Oh, I forgot about that. It, it randomizes the first attack. Yikes. So I should put Strike first. That's unfortunate. Not only did I lose Sensor Beam, but then I lose gold. That's unfortunate. It's a learning lesson, though. Can see 20 key apply one stun to an enemy? To all enemies? Stun every single enemy? That's kind of nuts. So one stun means you, they just don't do anything for a turn. It's kind of nuts. Let's do it. <clears throat> no, I didn't want to upgrade that. Ugh. Whoopsies. I was trying to see. Sensu being on this? Uh, I think not. I think not, right? Gosh, is pretty strong to get early. Gosh, is really strong actually. It's crazy. Just stun the enemy. <laughs> I mean, I could. Gets rid of some of my key, but that's okay. A lot to get a buffer up. Flare. That concussive blow is actually kind of insane. Because it scales up. That's actually probably a broken attack. The buffer didn't block crap. No, the buffer uh, <laughs> wasn't very good in that situation because of. Uh... Making it now is not bad.
More than 2%, super sentry. Sneko Eye? Sneko Eye is interesting to come at me, right? But no, I think right, we have a lot of zero cost stuff. We, we don't want Sneko. I can imagine maybe Pandora's box is okay. But we already got rid of so many same punches. Let's do Ring Dome. He thinks the game is even better than before? Why did he stop? I feel like Sanjibin gets worse and worse though, right? Because you don't necessarily want to do Sanjibin. I mean, I can see Sanjibin in this fight. This is fine. I gotta be careful for Majin Seal, right? So that actually makes my first attack is randomized. Oh, that's awesome. Just stun. Oh, if this is upgraded, it, consumes it stuns everybody. Excuse me, Max, it's people but being vulnerable is kind of eh. Yeah, plus fishing would call me. 100%. Majin still is still a thing, right? So if I do Majin still here, like. Hoping it doesn't. Okay, because what, what if it hits the guy right here that I don't want to kill? That's the problem. If that Majin seal. <clears throat> Nice. Plus, fashion and person would be interesting. So, I'm hoping it hits the guy in the back, right? So, I'm going to attack this guy instead. It's not, I mean, calculated. Calculated. Just in case he attacks. I don't know if he will. Uh, I'm a solar flare because I don't I don't have I have 14 region which is very nice and I don't know if this if he's gonna die or not uh, I was close to just killing him I, I want to save Kamehameha but I'm just gonna use it all right so I can only do 10 all right so if he if he's on the ground with oh because the sense of being is actually really good here because like I could even stun him and if I stun him he does I think that means if I stun him, he doesn't get back up to fly. So it makes him much easier to kill. The stun is actually insane. So if I just stun him again... He just stays on the ground. <laughs> that stun is stupid. Gain that much block. This seems, I don't know, I mean, that could be a very good way to block. But I don't know if I ever want to... I mean, if you have, like, good key region, this is fine, but this could very easily... I mean, this is very strong. This could be, like, 50-plus block easily. I will take it, fine. But I need my keys to do my command mans and stuff. So we just we discovered that this is actually really good. This concussive blow, it just does add some concussion, and that can just get it out of control. Might as well buy all the common relics out of the pool. I might only see common relics, by the way. Every common relic in the store, every common relic in the game, in my hands. <clears throat> Sense of being is almost like glitched the game a little bit. I think of Vajra. Spoon. Super Saiyan. Concussive. Kamea. Uh, I think I'm just have to be in here. Because we, we do have the ability to... Um, 
Stun, right? So I'm gonna stun, and then we're gonna do aftermatch, aftermatch, just to get the the vulnerable. So we have. Wait, why isn't he stacking buffers? So why is aftermatch not stacking two buffers? I play two, but I only get one buffer. Apply two stuns to all enemies. You're training. What? That's kind of insane. That's good to have after. Oh, I think I didn't keep in track of Sensor Bane. Whoopsies. My bad. More energy here. Do we have enough key to gain the energy? I think we've endured. We don't really care about the energy. We don't have enough card draw, so I'm going to skip here. Buffers are a little glitch, yeah. Prayer wheel, finally. We don't get a common relic. <sighs> Yeah, the buffers are a little weird right now. Soul spice. So does that does that work on dazed? I'm curious. Does soul spice work on dazed? Holy shit, it does. Soul spice on dazed is silly. Okay, they might as well stun this guy. Galkin. Strike. Are we censoring this guy? Maybe. I think that we have stuns in our deck. I think it makes it worth <clears throat> sensor bean. But I have to draw back into it. I can kill him or I can wait for sensor bean. I mean sensor bean seems kinda risky, you know? Because I don't have, have random costs and stuff. I think it's just I don't know. The guy's 120 HP and it's going to have... Yeah, it is greedy, but... Uh, we'll be greedy somewhere else. Because that's where I was taking damage anyways. <clears throat> I didn't really like that. Consume 8 key. Gain 2 plated armor. Apply 1. This is really cool. That's pretty cool, man. Do I have enough key to justify this? I do like CC capsule. I like plated armor though as well. So why is it so bugged? This card, three concussion. That's this is, really, this is a really good card. Super Saiyan three is really good. This this is a great buff. I mean. Stun all enemies. <coughs> it's actually nutty. I can probably go for like a lot of elites here. I should, I should probably be searching for elites. But I'm trying to go for the shop because I want to get rid of all my, my sand punches. And now the deck is really nice and petite. This is a... Nah, it's whatever. Let's skip. Yeah, it's a Super Saiyan 3 upgrade. So aftermatch works well with uh Yeah, it's a super sentry, why not? Sure. I was gonna say aftermatch works well with the thing that gives you the soul spice, right? So you can gain strength through the aftermatch. Let's do turtle shell, instant transfer, let's do CC, plot armor. Okay. Okay. Let's do plate armor. We could do an endure if we want to block for a shit ton. 83 damage first turn. So I might mess around and uh I might mess around and do sensor bean on this one. Are we? Sensor bean to this guy? That seems crazy. But you guys want me to be greedy? Uh, be greedy. Get the concussion going. So how much damage you can take per turn? 55 per turn? That's fine.
Well, I just gave I just gave a guy that was multi hits five strength. I just realized. I just realized. I wish the buffer was actually working properly. So if it, it we we realize it doesn't work properly, right? I want to get these out of my deck, but it's just gonna give me more days and it doesn't actually work properly, so I had to keep it in the deck. So we want to stun him. I don't have the key for the stun because I just does that kill me? By me not doing the stun, do I die? Probably. Hmm. Let's find out. We might die because I didn't get the stun. Hmm. Easy. Should have waited. Okay, that wasn't worth. That was like too greedy, but it worked. Whatever. Gain key. I mean, key is, was kind of running low there, wasn't it? Let's take a key key gain. I'm gonna go to the rest. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna rest again. Okay, key, key. We should have enough key that we need for a lifetime, right? I'm getting this out of the deck even though they don't stack. I don't know why. Feels bad. And now I could probably just die. We're fine. I can stun both of them. Might as well, right? Since you being her. I don't know if I can stun them for the rest of their life. And so, honestly, like, it's actually kind of interesting to, um, it's kind of interesting to do Sane Hubris to gain key and then Solar Flare just keeps stunning them, right? this card draw? I mean, I don't know. The deck's small enough that, like, if I'm drawing the Solar Flare enough, it's doing really good things. Because after to one card and gain a key region, you get to one plus double its... So this is a cool way to, like, thin out the deck. And I can gain key region, which would just allow me to... So basically what I could do is, if I keep honing, the deck gets smaller and smaller, and I just keep doing Solar Flare and something else. Solar Flare and something else. Which might become broken, but I'm kind of curious to try this. This is some more block, which I think we can utilize. I'm gonna do this instead. Who's the boss? Mm. I mean, if this works the way I think it's gonna work, I could just keep doing uh, Solar Flare. What am I going to use it on? 
So I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna try to get enough region to do solar flare every turn. So a 10 region. In a 20 region, I mean. At least 20 region. Should I get rid of Kamehameha or? Let's see. Kamehameha, do we say we'd rather get the region here? The damage I have will be Concussive Blow. So Concussive Blow will do all the damage I need. Did we lose region per turn? We don't, right? You can't stand kind of man, because you can have combo when you do the solar flare. Just want to get this out of the deck. And I might take some damage, but that's fine. Okay. And the region doesn't go down, does it? Only for the Super Saiyan thing, but after that, it's fine. I don't want to... So, I regenerate 33. So, if I do this, this is 70 block. But I regenerate 33 of it, so it's not too bad. But I'd rather... I'd rather not waste all my key. I'll get these out of the deck. I'm not using solar flare just yet. Although I could afford to. So I think we're at a situation where like once Super Saiyan runs down, we're gonna we can be solar flare every turn if we needed to. And it's like concussive blood to the damage. So my goal is to just do concussion, like, stun every single turn and concussion blow just to finish. I know it seems gimmicky, but... Yeah, I didn't want to stun there. I didn't, I didn't think I needed to. So I can get rid of Sensibin, because we're not Sensibin in this fight, right? So we just stun. Plated armor. Concussive carries. I want to draw. I want to hone. Get rid of my blocks. Stun. This is kind of broken. But sometimes in life, you got to break the game. We're also, getting, we're also getting, keep in mind, we're also getting like a um, ton of plated armor as well. So we can keep stacking up plated armor. I don't think I need the Hubris anymore. Yeah, I gain key, but I think we have enough region that we don't need the Hubris anymore. So we, I think we, I think now we just infinite stun and uh, concussive. Like, I don't even need this anymore, honestly. I can stun him multiple times. Does, does, does it apply? So does it do like two stun? Does it, uh, time to find out. I can double stun. That's crazy. So he, I can, if I if I do double stun multiple times, he actually he actually doesn't ever transfer. So I just keep him before he never actually transfers, and then he just dies to concussion. So I stun. Stun. And the guy's just stuck. It's disgusting. Stun. <laughs> so that's a broken mechanic. If you want to see broken mechanic, that's that's it right there. <clears throat> this is why you don't put that in the game. My region is is enough to sustain this. I could even sensor bean this. Honestly, I could keep sensor bean next time and get a free free uh, free relic. I'll do that next time. And I've also have 20 plated armor, 22. Yeah, I could have censored him. I, I I guess I didn't realize the, the power of my 
stun that I, I should have just done sensu. Okay. Consume up to 30 key and deal that much damage to all enemies. That's crazy. That's a, that's a finisher. Deal 50 damage. If this kills a non-enemy non -enemy minion, gain a, get a random potion. <clears throat> Gain region. Every time you gain combo, gain another combo. Randomize the target of the first attack you play each turn. Does this affect my combo of like... This just gives me region, which is very good for what I want to do. I'm getting region to just get more solar flares. But I don't care about getting multiple combos, right? It makes Kamehameha cheaper, but I think... We have like stun lock. Not that amazing. I mean... I make a lot of key, if you just noticed. So... And that last turn, the last run, I could have done like 200 damage to all enemies. Oh, I can only up to 60, so I, I could do 60 to everybody for two. I mean, if I can reliably do 60 to everybody, um, it's not that bad. I mean, 30 AoE is not that bad, but 60 is crazy. 60 AoE is like the bomb instantly, and key is a, a regener like a, a regenerable uh, <clears throat> resource that I can get burst of. So I can do like a burst of... Um, with what's it called cow ken and then i get like a lot of region stuff it's very easily just 60 damage aoe and i think AoE is a little bit of a weakness of mine and if anything if i don't want to play it i can use honing on this and gain region so more energy is never bad right busty crown would be kind of awkward i feel like we are doing such good things that we don't actually need to rest maybe that was a little bit Maybe that's a little bit ambitious, but so we could do the honing, right? To just make him, we could do the stun lock like we did last time, but. This guy adds burns to your deck, so I don't really like that. You know what I mean? But we'll stun him. And look, right there, that's 54 damage, AoE. He's dead. Now, the question is, <clears throat> do we want to try to milk some Sane Heart? Max HP, or do we want to maybe try to do Sensu Bean on this guy? I think the burns make this a little awkward fight. I'd rather just not have to deal with the burns, you know? But if he's stunned, then he's not giving me burns, and I can always get rid of the burns of Honing. So technically, we could try to milk this. I could hone the burns as well, but... Alright, I guess we can, we can give it a whirl. And see... See what we can do here. Um, is it not pixely? Yeah, it might be your connection. Or maybe, it doesn't matter if it's pixely to me. Yeah, I can endure, but then I need that. I need that key to, to be able to do the double flare. I think we're not gonna. It's not bothered with the double sensor here. I'd rather not bother. Every time you gain combo, draw a card. That could be kind of interesting, right? How necessary is that really? I don't need any of this stuff. Endure would be good as another block, but I think we keep the deck small. Oh, wait. We had other stuff. Retain a card, gain combo. Gain five key region. And five metallicides. That's so good for what our deck is doing. We want to get a lot of region and let's get the gold. Purity's pretty good. Panic button doesn't seem that bad either, because if we can stun, we can also use panic button buffers and, and stuff like that in conjunction. Um Panacea seems kind of good too, because we can do stuff like um Panic Button with Panacea. 
I, I don't know about this just yet, though. I, I don't, I'm not sure. See your weapon? Put an attack from your draw to your hand. That can pull up um, Genku Dama for the... For the kill. But I think... I mean, two things we can do with the deck. The deck can do Genku Dama and just destroy the, the fight. Or it can do Solar Flare and, and do some cheesy stuff. I could skip a lot of this stuff. See Panic would have been okay, though. Let's put, I was gonna go through the. Um, we can do Dolly's Mirror, so we can do um, double hone. No, double solar flare. Oh, solar flare is disgusting, and we have two of them now. Maybe that's a little necessary, but. This is very strong, right? Is there another store coming up? So let's try to melt the store a little bit then. <laughs> I like the bomb. No, but... I can, I can remove something. I, I, I'm thinking maybe... So I wanted to go for like this elite. And then use wing boost to get back to the store, but... Alright, so if we go for Act 4, we'll get, we'll get, uh, we'll get another store in Act 4. How about that? I'm gonna get rid of the second after image because it's actually it's bugged. We'll go for Act Three. I mean Act Four. So if I do Super Saiyan, this does 37 AOE, which is not bad. Let's do this instead. And now it's doing 41 AoE, but we can do this first. And now we can stun everybody, right? And we can also kill everybody. I can do that and... Yeah, let's just do that. Let's hope that she's not attacking. First turn. We have two solar flows in the deck though, right? So if I do... Honing... On like Ruthless Blow and Endure... Solar Flare feels a little bit better. I don't even have to do Panic Button here. What if I do... So, I might just do Kamehameha on the, um... On the minion here. I don't want to take damage. Alright, we'll show Solar Flaring. I could actually go for an infinite on the scroll and do Sensu Bean. I think if I Solar Flare, she doesn't actually spawn. So if I, if I keep doing Solar Flare, she doesn't spawn here. And that's kind of broken. I could do this for damage, but I will do it because we get the sense of being. She doesn't spawn minions. Yeah, that's kind of. So we can go ahead and get rid of this stuff. I forgot. Got to stun there, but it's okay because we're gonna stun twice now, and we're gonna do sensu bean, right? So we're gonna do sensu stun. We gotta be quick and start drawing back into honing. I'm gonna kill right now, so I have a chance to find honing. This is me being really greedy here. So that's that's double. I'm trying to draw to honing here. Oh, I already have honing. What am I talking about? So we can get rid of Kamehameha at this point, right? Because we have... That just gives us a lot of regen. And we want to make the deck uh, infinite here. I can actually do three suns a turn. Kamehameha just helps me with energy, though. I mean, it helps me with killing. But let's just do this. because We really want to, like, milk... We want to milk the infinite here.
No, this is unfortunate, actually. Just realized. Good buffer, so it's fine. But I just realized that I, uh... Okay. This is lame, I know, but also kind of fun. What's funny is that I guess I don't need the quickening. It doesn't really do anything for me. Neither does this. Sensu Bean. Okay, so she's done for a lot of turns, right? I could have home one of the solar flares. Uh. So she's done for like, what, how many turns? Five turns? Another solar flare. <laughs> I mean, it's strong enough that like, if I add it to my deck, I just get it early, and then eventually we'll just exhaust down to like the infinite, right? So you have to three current at the end of her turn, gain the choice. I mean, I think solar flare is often the best card in every deck. We always get rid of them, right? Uh, we want to go for the heart, the Scared of Shuriken, even though that would be kind of nice. So what are we honing here? This is not something you really want to mess around with this fight, right? But if you, if you stun him, then he never actually does his, um... I don't have the energy? Really? Damn. If you stun him, he never actually goes intangible, right? It's kind of interesting. That's a nice way to kind of cheat this guy. But no, I just kept him permanently intangible. Oh no, but the intangible wears off, but the stun, okay. Good to know. I could, I could probably sense you being this guy if I wanted to, but I think we're really good on, like, I don't know, I feel like it's fair to say we're pretty good on relics, right? Stun is a s silly mechanic, it's crazy. I think we're good on the... <clears throat> do it, do it for the meme? Fair. I'm not gonna lie, that is a little unfair. Gotta be quick. Get this out of my deck.
I wonder if this stops the... I'm curious. We gotta, we gotta somehow hone out the, uh... We gotta hone out the burns. That's problematic. Is that gonna reset his stunts? I hope not. It did. Yeah, so we're gonna do Apex after this. I, I, I'm, I think I'm being kind of unfair by being, I'm doing a really slow type of gameplay. It's a little unfair that we're, I'm delaying Apex for this. I'm having fun though. This is the last time I'll do this kind of shenanigans. <clears throat> I think once he's done for a decent amount of time, we'll go ahead and, uh... We'll go ahead and strike killing him. Like, this seems like a decent time to strike killing him, right? Yeah. This seems like a good time. How did I go infinite last time? Oh, because I had the ability. I had the ability to um. Every time I started a combo, I drew a card. Press on. This turn, when playing a card with key cost, ignore it and add a key burn to your discard instead. Push starter or follow up card from your drop pile. A starter or f follow up. Let's go ahead and just do bottle lighting on solar flare. Wow, what the hell? What a what an opening What an opening, actually. It's also good to keep in mind, Origin is having a lot of, uh, a lot of people are playing the game and trying to download it, so it's not as perfect. It takes some, it takes a decent amount of time on top of the fact that you're not getting like a perfect amount of uh, download speed from the server. Uh, the days makes this fight awkward. Oh, I just finished that I'm getting even more days. Give me a break. Just kill this guy, right? <laughs> you 
yet. On the days? Oh, it's two plus card costs? Is, is, does it work if it's zero? Maybe. Maybe I should be. I could try. Oh, it's too late now. Yeah, I think we should be like out of uh, more honing. We should be out. <clears throat> oh my god, our deck is disgusting. But I'm not gonna do the honing thing again. On, um, I'm just not. I think I'll do Genku, Genku Dama. Go away! Hey, seven months in a row. Welcome back, dude. STD. Appreciate that, dude. Oh, shit. Say I am mod seven months in here. We go away. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh, how perfect. Time Chamber just stunned, but I go in training, which is good because I just wanted to like, make the deck. Oh, it's actually not that good just because um, <clears throat> I had to get like honing. But I mean, it just buys me time, basically. And then I draw into Solar Flares and then I just go and do it again. Okay, the fight's gonna be over, don't worry. Alright? It's over. It's over. You don't gotta worry. We've 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 gone infinite. Or just about. We've just about gone infinite here. You're not quite we're not quite there yet, but it's it's getting there. Why did, I, why did I make a deck like this? What kind of person am I? I should probably upgrade my main social damage. You know, you're not wrong. I, I, I should do something like that. <clears throat> solar flare, solar flare, solar flare. And maybe that's better than Kamehameha? Come I don't think so. Oh, that's another solar flare. Okay, I kind of regret not seeing that. I wish I actually didn't draw into that one. Oh, can we just do Genku Dama? <laughs> draw one card. More exhaust. So this is kind of not bad because this is works over our exhaust mechanic. Imply armor seems kind of okay because nah, it's okay. We don't need any of this stuff. <clears throat> this is the reason why I actually want to do double lock. I was gonna say double solar flare, but I can't do double solar flare. I lied. I want you to double solar flare for this guy, but. <clears throat> I 
Genku Dama. I mean, that's good damage, right? Gross, man, it's gross. I'm gonna get hit by the constrictor. We have temporary HP. Put seven Dragon Balls. After collecting seven, you'll be given a choice to regret. You think I can do a seven Dragon Ball deck? How does this work? Try it out. Why not? Sure. Double dragon radar. What what is the upgrade of this? Makes it free. We, we said we can upgrade concussive blow, right? Yeah. Why not? Okay, so Super Saiyan, Solar Flare, Instant Transfer. Damn, I don't have enough for double Solar Flare. More powers. Because why not? I know, it's super boring. I know, I, I just, I, I just want to end it because I don't see what they're doing. And, and I'm just kind of like from a stun, so it's just solitaire. <laughs> You're not wrong. This is 100% solid right now. I 100% agree with you. Solid here. Okay, we can do Dragon Ball. <laughs> the problem here is, um, I'm gonna take damage. I wanna play this, but I'm gonna take damage. So maybe I do that and just play that for no damage. And then the next turn we're gonna have stuns. One more Dragon Ball. What happens? Obtain incredible power. Receive limitless resilience. <clears throat> become filled with determination. Vanquish your enemies. So does this insta kill him? If I vanquish? What sounds like the best thing to do? Determination. Resilience. Incredible power. <clears throat> vanquish. Are we ready to vanquish? Limitless resilience, power. You guys are all different, huh? Let's try vanquish. A little lame. So much for vanquishing. What the hell? You barely touched him.
You can set a concussion blow. I, I get rid of. Let's see. Grr. I just I don't even know if I want to do the heart. The, the the deck can't lose. Can we just like claim a a guaranteed win? Yeah, I can I can do the heart. I can insta stun him. I, mean, I can stun him for the rest of his life. He never attacks me, and I can do two hundred damage a turn. Or I could. Honestly, it gets to a point where, like, okay, sure, there is a situation where, like, one da one card, one damage per card that I play. So I gotta play around that. He would, there would never be more than one damage because <clears throat> he never can scale it up. So, yeah, I gotta think how I can manage that. But I don't have to only insta stun him, I can just still play regularly. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I would have to do a different approach to kill him. Yeah, I mean, this wasn't really interactive. <laughs> it's not really interactive gameplay. And uh, yeah, the heart passive would kill me, but uh, <laughs> well, no, the, the heart passive has to kill me before I kill him. So basically, it's saying, can I do 800 damage or 200 damage or 300 damage a turn in the span that it takes for him to kill me? It's just gonna be a battle of <clears throat> resident sleeper, I feel like. But like, especially if I do Genka Drama, Genka Dama, just for a lot more damage, I can keep stuff like that. That's pretty good for the elite. Block stun repeat. Yeah, just keep a block. Block stun repeat. That's that. Gambling chip is pretty good, right? Eh, not really. So we don't care about blocks, right? I wonder what the hell the next Dragon Ball thing would be. I could do this so I can retain the stun, but nah. I, mean, I guess I'll just take this. What was the other thing? I mean, I guess I could just do after image. Do we care about the buffer? I like this as damage. Let's see what else we can do here. Alright, their attack cards are also shorter. It's not bad, but let's do this. This could be painful. This could be painful, actually. Solar flare. <laughs> the MAI and concussion blow. I could just use that to get out of the deck. I did this to myself, alright? I, I created a deck that was just stupid. Yankee Diamond just kills him, right? 
or yeah, close to it. The Dragon Balls to success what they do. We could. I didn't, I didn't necessarily want to take damage here. Oh well. I blame it on the Dragon Balls. Oh, we didn't take damage. Okay, we're fine. Let's just see what they do. <laughs> okay, let's see what resilience is. Six dexterity and ten plated armor. It's not bad. Still not that useful for the heart, I would say. Okay, let's start doing some honing, some nanny against, right? Like, I'm gonna hone this bad boy. We wanna keep some block, though, right? We, we determined that we wanna keep some block. We're not gonna keep Genka. We're not keeping that stuff. Oh, but we could keep that for the damage, right? Because that is like uh, crap ton of damage. We could do Dragon Ball as well, but eh, it's a little awkward. Storm pot. This deck is Resident Evil. I agree. I agree. I, I I created this myself. I I did this to myself. This is on me. This is all on me. We're trying to see what the uh Look okay, at Papa, I got you. <laughs> Dragon was way too easy to find. You're not wrong. I think we just go infinite now. So what are we doing? If we did the resilience, it gives us some dexterity and some shenanigans. So destruction does 99 damage, does nothing. Determination, I'm not sure what that does. Maybe like ener more energy. But what if we do power? Let's try incredible power. We'll get strength. Not fair. So then determination would be... I'm not even sure. A heal? What the? What could it be? I got rid of the slime, that was not bad. I took so long in like uh, doing this. That now, like my dogs have to eat and also have to go outside.
<laughs> Endure was so useless. We did it. That was so long, but it was fun, guys. It was fun. You know what? I would expect the Super Saiyan to come in and just stun the Spire and just have its way, you know? It, it's only fitting. <laughs> the stun is just a broken mechanic. If I were to play this again, I would force myself not to use the stun and try something different, but that was fun.